Dinosaur Project. My name is Jordi and this is a video about my hair. So a lot of people ask me about uh, different things I do with my hair, you know, do, do I curl it or is it just naturally like this? How do I get it to be so curly and stuff like that? So I thought I'd do a video about it uh, to answer all questions so hopefully I get less of them. It's not necessarily that I mind answering questions or that it's like bothering me or anything. But I mean, if you answer the same questions for 20 years. So first things first, I don't curl my hair. It is naturally curly. It is naturally like this. Uh, it is not, well, almost naturally this color. Uh, there are some bits that are sort of bleached in there from back when my hair was purple. For the most part, it is all natural. It's uh, tied back, it's braided back, actually. I don't know if you can see, but I braided the front bit back so it's out of my face because I am in a show that opened this past weekend, which is also why I'm wearing so much makeup. I don't like wearing this much makeup. Mostly stuff on my skin. I like to keep that really natural as well, so barring very rare circumstances, I will never wear anything on my skin. Uh, but this isn't a video about my skin, this is a video about my hair. So I don't use a lot of products in my hair. Um, mostly because I don't understand them. I just kind of wash it. So I used to wash my hair every day back when I was in like middle school, high school, but then I sort of went to like every other day. There was a while when I was conditioning every day, but shampooing every other day. I nowadays, especially now that it's shorter and I don't have to worry about it getting super tangled because when my hair was long it would get super tangly so easily because it's so curly. Uh, whoa. Sorry, there's a swarm of birds that lives on campus and they all just flew past my window at once and it was terrifying. Anyway, so I just sort of wash it, you know, whenever, every few days or so, whenever it I don't know, whenever it starts to feel like it could use a wash. Because another thing with the curls is it kind of like disguises everything, really. So I don't use a lot of products in my hair, but I do use shampoo and conditioner. I use these ones, these, these purple boys here. Wow. Ooh. I use Herbal Essences Totally Twisted Shampoo and Conditioner. Um, this isn't a sponsored video or anything. I just, this is what I use and they're really nice. Um, it smells like fairies, which I really like because I love things that smell good and I love fruity smells. That's like one of my favorite things about when I've just washed my hair is when it, when it smells all fruity because I washed it with all these berries and things. Uh, but yeah, I've been using these since high school, I think somewhere around high school-ish. I switched over to Herbal Essences because I used to use Pantene when they had one especially for curly hair, but then they stopped making the ones with, either they stopped making the ones with curly hair or they stopped making them in the big size bottles. They only had small ones and I didn't want to do that because it's less expensive to when you buy the larger bottles because you get, like, to, to get as much of the product but only buying smaller bottles is more expensive. Price per unit. Nah. But so then I had to, I, I wanted to find a new shampoo and conditioner because I wanted something that would be less expensive per unit and something that I could use for curly hair. So I used these. Wow, aren't they purple? So I guess I'll just sort of like go through how I treat my hair and what I do with it. I don't know if you can tell, but I'm kind of winging this. I don't usually do like beauty related things because I 100% do not consider myself any sort of authority. I am super low maintenance, but people ask me questions about this all the time. So I figured I'd clear that up. Okay. so Before I shower, uh, when I'm going to wash my hair like I am tonight, uh, I always like to brush it out first because it um, helps get rid of a lot of the loose hair so you're not shedding half your head into the drain because that's really, it's hard on the drain and it's annoying for people who have to shower after you so I'm going to brush my hair out. Alright, so uh, people with curly hair, we don't really brush our hair that often. This is why, because it just does this. 
which is a mess. <laughs> All right, I'm gonna go wash my hair and then I'll be back. Okay, so, take a shower. Washed my hair, got all this gack off my face from the show today. Washed my hair. And then after I got out of the shower, to dry it, I wrapped it up not in a towel, but in a cotton t-shirt, the same way you would wrap your hair up in a towel. For curly hair especially, just plain cotton, so like soft, plain whatever cotton t-shirts are a lot easier on the curls. Also, uh, when I just dyed my hair, I'll use like a paint t-shirt or something so I don't like ruin a towel or a shirt or something like that with excess dye washing out right after you've gotten it, or after I've gotten it dyed. I just relate at this point and less coherent than I was earlier. Uh, but so that's sort of just what I do with that. Then once it's out of the towel, once you're satisfied with how dry it is, then it's you gotta, you gotta scrunch it. It's all about the scrunched after you've washed it with adequate amounts of shampoo and conditioner, by which I mean reasonable amounts of shampoo and far more conditioner than anyone with my hair length could possibly need. Then you gotta scrunch it. Uh, and then what I do is I go to sleep. I sleep on my hair wet. Um, it really helps tone down frizz so it's not really frizzy and crazy and it helps shape it so it's nice and fluffy instead of, uh, you know, the curls are nice and fluffy and bouncy instead of being weighed down, I guess, or something. Why is it doing this? What is, I don't know what's going on. I gotta sleep on it. I'll see you in the morning. Okay, it's 7.30 and I just woke up, so but it's 7.30 so we're gonna be a little quiet right now. So I just woke up. I'm just sleeping on my wash clean hair and uh, it's uh, a. <sighs> I'm doing a lot. So, in order to combat it doing a lot, what we actually do is we just leave it. We let it be while I get ready, while I wake up and everything. Oh, oh we're gonna get ready. decided that today I want to see out of both my eyes, so we're going to pin this, uh, this fluffy front bit here back a little bit. So we usually just take a few bobby pins, they're brown, and I take a little bit of the front part here and just sort of pin it back, or move it back I guess, I haven't gotten the pins yet. Uh, but just sort of move it back just a little bit so it's still nice and fluffy, but it's not directly in my line of sight. And you just take the pins and you put it proper you see fit. And yeah, that's okay. I usually do the crisscross one sort of thing, one coming in from the top and one from the bottom. That doesn't look as okay as it did a second ago. So, I mean, really the way my hair works is I just wing it, first of all. <laughs> uh, second of all, it is very natural. I don't use a lot of, like, products or anything with my hair. Um, I just sort of let it be. I'm going to pin part of this back, too, because I don't like that doing what it's doing. Okay, so that's just about all I ever really do with my hair. I hope this clears up some of the questions people always ask me about. Is my hair naturally like that? What do I do to get it to look like that? I wash it occasionally and then I sleep on it and it's great and lovely and ooh isn't it so curly and wonderful wow incredible anyway I'm gonna cut this video here because I have to go to class 
Thank you all so much for watching. Uh, if you haven't already, be sure to hit the subscribe button down below. If you like this video, be sure to show that like button some love and leave a comment if you do any crazy things with your hair, if you want to see me do any crazy things with my hair because believe me, I've done some crazy things with my hair in the past. Anyway, I'll see y'all later. Bye.